Huh. Oh, you don't realize how steep that path is. My goodness. Oh, yes. Oh. Yep. This whole thing's gonna collapse. Look at that. This whole thing's gonna fall down. Oh, it's moving. Oh! Hold on, wait. I sank. <laughs> I started to sink a little bit right there. It freaked me out. Ooh. Alright, got a bunch of stuff. The sun's gonna poke through there any second now. <laughs> oh, uh oh, what is that? What's poking through the cloud right there? About as far in as I can get. Can't get any closer. Hmm. Yes, that tower is annoying. I see that tower. Do I want that tower? No, I don't, but I, it's there. Look at that. Yes. Alright, we're not gonna watch the whole thing. I gotta get home. I got a video to edit. That's what I did today. I shot a video, so I'm gonna go. Let's just get started into something. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I haven't recorded any videos since that aerial project. What I'm doing right now Getting ready to go to a park. We did a shoot yesterday. The agent feels like we didn't show enough water. So there's a park right next to the house. With my super zoom lens, get some nice back shots of the house. So you see a house up on a hill. It would look great. All right, we got the GoPro. I synced up all the cameras again, so you all should be saying the same time. So you don't have the problem last time where I put you in the timeline and everything was just everywhere. Nothing really extreme, just a quick little two photos. And that's it. Well, that's gonna bring the drone, but it's a bit too windy. Oh look, a goose. Hello, goose. Today is siren testing day. <laughs> wasn't that exciting. The park isn't that big. A little circle with the playground. So, eh. Well, I grabbed the new camera because you're the one that had the lens on it, and then I grabbed the microphone to see if we could get better audio. But I forgot you were broken. It is Easter Sunday. Could it be the Easter Sunday thing? Taxes. <gasps> I need to do our taxes. I got a call from the park people. We have a ribbon down here for you. Oh. Mm. Well, I didn't know if they were gonna do the ribbon. Because it was online only and they're not doing anything, you know, physical. So I didn't know if they would do it. But sure enough, they did. So I guess I was supposed to go down and get a ribbon. So she's like, we can mail it to you if you want. And I was oh, that'd be great, thank you. Which means if I get a ribbon, it's gonna have to go somewhere. Mm, guess what came in the mail? Oh, oh here it is! Um, do, 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 do. It looks different than the last one. The camera design's different. But what? we got something going on on the radar. Nice and red. Oh yes, but if we look at the lightning map, nothing. It's all fake. This isn't a storm. 
It's all lies. I didn't want any storms anyways. I'll be fine. I like if I go to the weather channel, I get bombarded because I have ad block. But then there's Weather Underground. It's not yelling at me. Who owns Weather Underground? The Weather Channel! So it's like I'm still using the Weather Channel, but I'm not. Ooh! Went through and did my taxes, and... Ouch. Even though it looks like I made a boatload last year. It's not true. <laughs> when I see the number, I'm like, ooh, how much of that would they take? And it turns out it was a lot. Whew. I just saw the money go away. <sighs> there it goes. It's gone. <laughs> just take my money. Go ahead. Uh, build a road somewhere. I don't care. <sighs> how does that keep happening? There's a race tomorrow. My dad's tractor. He painted it purple and blue. My mom and my aunt, who comes to all the races, they actually bought some clothes to match the style that's purple and blue. I realized they don't have any purple shirts. So I googled. That's the only one that I could find. I mean, it doesn't look that bad. Some other shirts came up. Some new colors for some shirts that I bought before. This brand where I got this yellow shirt. There's a dark blue. That's almost a purple. This is the one I got. Then there's this dark blue. And then there's this green one. So when I'm buying more shirts again, I can't stop. They did a nice little three bedroom home. He's sending me a bunch of info about it. Like saying, hey, we did this nice home. It's just your size. Maybe you should do it. A <laughs> hundred and ten thousand! You could have shared winter. I've been living with people for 28 years. I'm done. The best time I had was last year. Oh, no, that, was, that was two years ago. Two years ago, when I stayed at the aunt's house for four months. It was the best, except for having the dog. The dog was annoying. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. The dog is just, she, she's the dog. But she's needy. All I hear every night is the TV for my mom. Her movie's going off. All I hear is the TV out there going off. It's a mess in here, okay? And I just, I don't, I don't want to have people. I just want to be away from everybody. But not too far. I still want to be with the family in case, because I still help the grandparents every Thursday. We do stuff with them. I kind of want to be there for them like how I was with my grandma. I was up there every weekend. They've been gone. Oh, it's almost 10 years since my grandma died. Anyways, I like how I got all salty at myself for taking a two-month gap between the last photos. And now here I am again. I just don't feel like doing anything. Except for another drone photo. But the St. Pat's Park where I want to go costs money now. They said it was on weekends and holidays and it was Easter when I tried to go last time. So maybe if I go during the week, it won't cost any money. It's you. I have a new boss. He's found somebody to replace him. And the person is somebody who already runs another next door photo up north, the Kalamazoo team. She's going to run Kalamazoo, and then she's also going to run us at the same time. She's going to have two next door photos. My good, that's double the profit. How much is she making? My goodness, can I have some of it? <sighs> I had a meeting with her. She brought up the drone stuff, and I told her. I explained why I don't want to, all the legality stuff. I have to register that drone. If I was going to register it, I would have just got a better drone than that. I would have got a bigger drone. She's very persistent, and she's like, Our goal is to get you certified by June 1st. Uh, did you just... Did you hear what I said? <laughs> she asked if I took the pilot course. I'm like, oh yeah, I already took that course. And she's like, you took the course. I'm like, yeah, I took the course. And you didn't get certified, and you took the course. I'm sorry. <laughs> I... June 1st, the goal, be certified. Okay, thank you. Okay. I should probably clean the room. Maybe today will finally be the day where I get this place in tip-top shape. There was a big gap between the drone photo and the last photo before that is because I was trying to get the drone photo and I just couldn't because that park was busy all the time. But like right now, there's a big gap because I just don't feel like doing anything. And when I just don't feel like doing anything, I just feel just... Ugh. That's when this happens. You can tell. So if you want to know how I'm feeling... Look at the room. 
I bought a bunch of new shirts. These are all the new shirts. I wore all the new shirts, by the way. The purple one is just gorgeous. And then there's the new textured blue one. I wore the textured blue one. And then there's the textured green one. I wore that too. And then I haven't worn yellow in a while, so I wore the yellow. They had this page with all these colors. Oh my goodness, look at this. I've been looking for orange and look, look at this orange one. Oh, it's so pretty. There's the blue and green one that I bought. So there's blue and orange. There's blue and green. There's blue and white. There's this pink one. I wanted to get this pink one, but it's not available. This yellow one. I wanted some more yellow shirts, so I got another yellow shirt. And then there's this one with the blue, green, and white. It's like a mix of all of them, but that one isn't available. <laughs> Who's there? Who is it? Hello! And then there's this one. Oh, I wanted this one so bad. This one. Contrast. Oh, but no! It's unavailable. It doesn't exist. <laughs> Anyways, but yes. I've bought even more shirts. They'll be here tomorrow. Oh, uh, I'm at 50? Am I at 50 now? I get to go to some of the coolest places. Some of them drive in theater. What, what's going on? Hmm. I feel like I've been here before. Fascinating. <sighs> you gotta break down the box anyways to fit it into the recycling, so might as well stab it a few times and get some anger out, you know, you just need to do once. You're walking through the kitchen. Oh, there's an evil box! Oh my goodness! Oh. And the little knife doesn't really do anything. It didn't do anything! Oh! Well, I don't see anything in there. Do you see anything in there? What's in there? I'm tired of the room looking like this. We're gonna fix that. Everything has a place. It's just, I'm too lazy to put it back in its place because I just bring it out anyways again, so why put it away? plus nine, 58 shirts. 59. I bought all these. And each shirt isn't cheap. Usually a shirt costs like 15, maybe $20. It's organized, at least. It's not just a mess. So, there we go. Whoa. Feels like I've gone back in time. Goodness. We had this carpet back at the old house. Lights. Uh-oh. Who dis? Hello there. How are you today? Yes. Hello. Nobody gives her attention here at this house. Hello. I'm jumping in from the future. Uh, this video was seven and a half hours unedited. I have a lot. So I cut out a bunch about the new boss and whatnot, what it's going to be like. Every house that I was at, I was always like looking at the house. Like if it was my size, like it was just like a few bedrooms, a tiny little place. I was like, oh, look at this house. I want to get it. When I was at the ants, which you just saw, we were like, well, if I was going to get a house, we need to fix my credit score because it's a little low. The hospital bills from the last time the lung collapsed were affecting that, and I paid those off. But when we looked at a credit score, it was still affecting the credit score. So we had to dispute that, and then we were thinking of ways to build the credit 
So what the aunt did with her kids and herself is that they got credit builder cards. They've got special cards that are used to build your credit. They only have a little bit on it. So you pretty much pay for gas, buy a little bit of food with it, and then pay it off right away, and boom, it builds your credit. So we applied for one of those, and I got approved. Boom, here it is. It's purple. Oh, oh there it goes. Oh, look at that. It's purple. It's purple. So I have a credit card. So now we can slowly build the credit. I'm jumping in one more time before we get back to the video. I was watching about the credit score and all that, and I decided to check again. It's been a wink since I just recorded that last part. Time is flying. I checked the credit score again to see how much the credit card's helping and if that dispute went through. I filed a dispute for that hospital bill saying to get it off and it said it was being processed. And if I tried to like file another dispute, it would say this dispute's already being processed. And I can now file for another dispute because it's still there. It, it didn't go away. It's still there even though I paid it. Having the credit card though, my goodness. My credit score has gone up a hundred points. A whole hundred points. This is wonderful. It's actually working. It's working. Thank you, Aunt. The Aunt knows what she's doing. We're getting ready to finally get out of here. The time has come. Let's go. Look at how huge they are. Oh, goodness. Oh, adorable. My goodness. These dudes, they're huge! And they're staring at me. <laughs> How long has it been? <laughs> what am I doing? On Thursday, I am going to go to the airport and I am going to take the test. We'll see what happens if I become a pilot. It's my sister's birthday, so we're eating cake. Tomorrow, 2 p.m. I have to go to the Goshen Airport, which is next to the Ant, so after I go to the Goshen Airport, I'll stop by the Ant. We're doing the test. Just got through looking over the maps. I wanted to do the maps last, the night before. I'm still thinking about what to do. When we did the Holga and the medium format camera for the college, I went to this bridge and we got a photo of this bridge, and I did a photo on the bridge with the Holga. I could go there and do like a drone photo there, like me looking out on the bridge. They were already giving me aerial photos. She gave it to me like, oh, we'll see you there, but what if I fail? Gotta be prepared for that. Just don't assume I'm going to pass, even though I feel like I am. Howdy. <laughs> I finished an hour early. That's a good thing, that's a bad thing. I don't know. I'm not gonna tell you, because I'm gonna tell the aunt. Hello? Right. What were your results? Ah, pass! 72 percent! Barely, Woo! but yes, I passed. You fill out some stuff to get the certificate in the mail, okay. and then that's it. So I get the little card, and I'm, right. I'm certified. And we're back home. Uh, it looks like it's gonna rain. I have a horrible headache because it's been so stressful for the past month trying to get this done. I passed. We're done. I'm gonna take a nap. Today was a tricky day to have my first aerial shoot because we get wind gusts coming in out of nowhere and it, it yelled at me quite a few times saying, hey, it's a windy up here. And all these trees, it's surrounded by trees. I couldn't get anything on the front. I had to stuff it in between here, like up in here in the branches trying to get a side shot. <sighs> but I did my best and I got some good stuff. The people that live in this house are my kind of people. That's a pineapple. That's a sponge. That's a Gary. That's Squidward's house. <laughs> so I show up at this chute. I go to get out of the car and clunk. This breaks. It breaks? Yeah, it kind of. It just. It just broke. <laughs> so I just push it back and then. I can still get open. Yeah, it just kind of broke. Broke off all in there. Oh. oh, there it is. We should get closer. But no, I cannot get closer. Jupiter. And then, right there. Saturn. Jupiter. Saturn. The moon. Mars. Next to the moon. Right there. 
That's how bright it is out here. It's gonna get one exposure of the moon, like this. Okay, now it's gonna get another. Like this. And then blend it both together. Ah, uh, yes. The time has come. You can't stop me. I can't be stopped. I'm editing this video. I was talking about the shirts and how I bought the shirts. Well, something happened again. Okay. And now here we are again. I'm cutting in once again. I was editing the video and I got to that part and I'm like, well, I talk about a bunch of stuff in this one little part and I'm going to do the short condensed version. So in the winter, I was like, I don't have enough colorful jackets to match the colorful shirts. I got this orange one. I got that worn out tiny red one. I got this one and I got this one. I need more colors to match the colorful shirts. So I bought all the colorful jackets, which kind of fell off onto the floor, but you can see them down there. The purple, maroon, the red one, all that. Now we're in summer and I'm thinking I can't wear jackets all the time because I like the long sleeves. I like the coverage. I like to be covered. It's just my thing. Doing the photo shoots, we have like a nice little uniform, little blue shirt, you know, but a short sleeve. And so underneath it, I wear this little silky white one all the time. Can this little light undershirt come in different colors? And sure enough, it does. <laughs> Look at that. There's a nice green one. Look at this green. I pretty much found all the colors of the jackets that I bought in these little undershirts. <gasps> like there's this beautiful faded orange to match the faded orange shirt which I already wore which is down there dirty but anyways there's faded orange there's the blue there's bright neon yellow and orange and maroon and the red and the black and the white and then there's there's the pink I found a pink one so now I've got a bunch of randomly colored undershirts so I can still have long sleeves and I can still match with nice color combinations like this there you go that was the most recent purchase for the shirts, but I think I'm done. I tried to find, while I was finding these, I tried to find more striped shirts and I literally can't find ones that I've already not bought. So I've kind of already bought everything that I can buy. I'm, I'm done.
taxes. <laughs> oh, I didn't record much on the way back because it was boring. But I get back and uh, uh. I was all stuffy before we left. Well, we were leaving. I got better. And now that we're back, oh, well, I'm stuffy again. I must be allergic to this area. Oh, mm. Mm. soak it in. New shirt, the new pink. I'm gorgeous. Gorgeous, look at me. I can wear whatever color I want to wear. All the girls can wear pink. Well, you know what? You can just take that rule and just... I've been so busy. I'm trying to... I've, I've thought of ideas to finish off this project. This video is so long and it's just full of just... What? So I'm thinking of ideas, but I've just... Things have been quite busy recently. And I haven't really had, like, any time to do anything. We're gonna make it work. So, anyways... You're dying, so I'm just gonna just put you down. You're you're dead. Sorry, you're gonna die in about. Well, this one fell off the stick, so I'm just gonna light and throw it. There it goes. I lit it and I threw it. If it comes back at me, well, oh. <laughs> I didn't even do anything. 
it just went. There it goes. Can't go back now. Oh, wow. Doing pretty sparkles. Look at it go. Oh dear. Did I do that? That's a fountain of fire. Um, that one exploded just a little bit. What you looking at? That's what I thought. Ooh, see, same thing. They all do the same thing. They put out my flame. I did it. Oh. Ooh, um. oh, look at the fire. Wow. Oh, look at it go. Are we done? No. Oh. The one's just a fireball. Oh. Uh. What? What is? What is that? What is it doing? Do you, do you see what it's? What is it? Do? What was that? It's still fizzling. Oh, now it's going. That's such a puny little thing, my goodness. Whatever. Hey now, hey now. Calm down. Breathe, breathe. Probably shouldn't be this close, but hey. If it comes back at me, we got a problem. <laughs> oh. Let's try an epic extravaganza. I am a professional fuse tire. This might be the most I've ever done. Uh-oh, you're down. Oh no. That's it. They're all right there. One cluster of fuses. Oh, I don't know. Oh dear. No, no, they're all on fire. <gasps> Half of them came back at me. <laughs> Uh-oh. Well, it's too bad I was recording a slow-mo for that one. What do you want? I don't have a slow-mo of them taking off. And I was doing that, and one didn't take off. It happened twice! What in the world? What? What, what is wrong? You see that last one? I still ran. Because it went and like didn't go. It like didn't have any thrusts and I thought it wasn't going to lift off again. But it finally did! Holy cow, that was scary. Good heavens! I see that in the trees! I can see that! There we go, there we go, there we go. I'm gonna grab you. 
smoke comes out. Oh uh, yeah. There it goes. Run. Pack it up. Pack it up. Pack it up. Oh. I have an idea. Instead of just launching fireworks outside, why don't we just launch fireworks virtually? Oh, there it goes. Oh. 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 Mm. Wow. There it goes. Off into space. Okay, all dead. I'm dead. I'm surprised the computer... I'm surprised the computer lasted. <laughs> and there we go. Oh. Wow. Mmm, I have a headache for the first time. I did every product at a house. Everything I did. Floor plan with a tour. There was video, aerial video, ground video, a walkthrough, aerial photos, normal photos. There was a lot. Uh oh. I got something in the mail. Federal aviation. I wonder what it is. It's my pilot license. I would show it, but it's like showing someone's driver's license. You kind of can't, because somebody can just take this and then use it. It's a nice uh, tricolor. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, they're, they're, it's there. This is it. This is an official pilot license. Right here. I'm upgrading the monitor again. Oh no. I didn't want to go up to 4K, because I didn't know if I could, because I only had the Mac at the time. And so I didn't know if the Mac could, like, output at 4K. Now here we are. I've got a nice, beefy computer. I think I can go up to 4K. 32 inch. Smart TV. It's a smart TV, but also a monitor. 340. I paid 270 for this one. I might snatch it right now before the price goes up. 32 inches. I just want to see the size of this one, because it's the perfect size to fit on this desk. It's the perfect size. It's 32 inches to match this one. The bezels are, like, smaller than anything. <laughs> I'm getting it. The best thing about my setup is that I can be anywhere. I have a laptop. I can work from anywhere. Everything's mobile. I can plug it all into one power strip and just work from anywhere. Just pack it all up and go anywhere. Like the aunt's house. Or here, the brother's house. Here I am. I'm at the brother's house with the kitties. What are you doing? You demons! What? Get out of my mashed potatoes! Why? Why? There's not really much to do. This would be like how it would be if I was out on my own. I would be in a place and I'd just... However, this is one thing that I miss about not having a Jolly Molly in the house. It's this. It's under the couch. Where did it go? It's gone. Poof. To do this with the dog, with this laser, this nice bright one, so they would see it. Didn't work. Whoa. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> yes. Oh. Do you have to make the noises every time you do that? Let's see what I have to deal with. Uh, I guess I'm not using the mouse. It's fine. I didn't want to use the mouse. It's okay. And now it's raining. 
but it's kind of it's kind of running straight down, so I can't open it too far. But oh yeah, I'm back home. Probably should have said that. I haven't put the desk back together yet. Nothing's put together because I'm waiting for the new monitor. It's supposed to come today, and it and it came today. I got home and it's just sitting there on the porch. Okay, cool, great, thanks. Everybody's home. Nobody knew it was there sitting on the porch. I guess the Amazon guy didn't knock and say, hey, you know, there's a very important box out here. Hmm. Hmm. I've plugged everything in. It's all here. Whoa, that's tiny. The max outputting in 4K. The max outputting in 4K. Oh, I don't think I should do that. Are you okay? Look how tiny that is. <gasps> that's so small. Oh my goodness. All right, this is running at 4K. Automatically bumped up the scale to 150. Well, what if I just set it to 100? game should I play in 4K? Of course I picked Minecraft. Why would I pick something else? Why is everything so small? Wow. That's 4K Minecraft. What is this? I've had this photo idea for a while, but I didn't feel like doing it. I usually do a photo with how I feel, pretty much. But lately, I haven't been feeling anything. Which is why it's been three months, almost, since my last photo. Official photo and video. This happens from time to time where I just, like, don't do anything. I get on a stride where I'm doing a bunch, and then I just don't do anything for three months. So I could either one, do a photo of me just laying in the bed feeling nothing, but I've kind of already done that. I was thinking of just me curled up in a ball, lying on the floor in all the mess. I cleaned the room, and look, it's already back to how it was before, because that's just how I feel. But I have another idea. I was thinking of just me, instead of me curled up on the floor in here, I want to be curled up in the yard. Laying in the yard, not feeling anything. I'm in the warm glow of the sunset. It's all nice and lovely, yet I'm sad and gloomy and just don't feel like doing anything. So let's do that. Let's finally shoot a photo showing how I feel. That's what these photos are for. I'm just gonna leave you sit over here so you can kind of see. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to be up that high. Get him! Don't let him boss you around. Don't take no for an answer. Oh, she's mad now. The Mohawk's going. She's mad now. I don't think he cares. that note apparently. That, that chord. That chord was very interesting to him. Here we are. We're back inside. Just crop in a little bit. Then they'll let me get rid of the shadow. And there we go.
That's all. This will do. I kind of want to be in black and white though, but not completely. I do like a thing around me. The saturation. Around me. So it's all black and white where I am. <gasps> Ta da! Uh, what? Is that too artsy? Too symbolic? Is that too much? Is that too on the nose? I want it to be subtle, but not like obvious. You know? <laughs> Actually, whoa, wait. Whoa. See, when I do that, when I, do, when, I, when I do what you just saw there, that's when it clicked, <laughs> and I actually see it now. I'm okay with this. There's a lot going on. I mean, it's pretty straightforward, though. You can see all the stuff over here. I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory, all the smart layers and whatnot. And then... Is it too much? Is it too much? You know what? No. I'm going with it. That was the original. Boom. Boom. Yep. That's a photo. I finally realized why I didn't have anything today. Today is my day off for some reason. I thought it was still Tuesday or Monday. We're not doing anything, so uh, I guess I should just go to a park. So let's just go to that park and, uh, yeah. Because the plane was supposed to be, you know, dark and moody over at the park, too, but no, I like being out in the parks. So I guess maybe I'm dark and moody at home, but then I get out and I'm happy, I guess? No, because I'm not happy being out. I like being at home. It's the opposite. I don't know. I'm confusing the story. I don't know. There's got to be a plan. There's got to be a story. Dull world out there of brown and green. Just a bright pink with like there I am. Watch out. Here I am. Look out. Here I am. You know? I mean these two together. Oh my goodness. I'm wearing this. Of course, as I get here, more people are pulling in. I'm here with more people walk around just as I get here. We might have a problem though. This overlook spot when we were here with the ant, we just came out of winter, so it was nice and clear, but uh it's all overgrown with uh, trees. It's not going to work out like I planned, so I could try a straight-on shot. This park is a little closer to the airport, so here I can only go to 200 feet, but at home I can go to 400 feet. There it is. It looks a little bigger. Does it look bigger than last time? It looks bigger for some reason. I don't know why. It's a good spot where I could at least plop the drone down and try to take off and see what happens. yelling at me about the airspace. Okay, just hit confirm. Oh, there we go. I just hit confirm like, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm qualified enough to fly and now it's gone. So yes, we can fly. Just gonna... Uh, here we are. We're back. No. I don't know what else to do for this project. I mean, uh, sure, I could think of something, but I just. Not 
got a face on. Well, it's getting a lot more complex. Usually it's just a layer. I edit the photo and boom, we're done. But now we're like, I'm doing curves, selecting things out, multiple masks. Like, <laughs> I'm really like getting really detailed with the photos. It's fascinating. It's very fascinating. Are they connected? No, they're not connected at all. What do I do? How do I connect these two together? How do we do that? How do we do that? So I had this photo and then I shot this photo and I'm like, okay, so I have these two. How do we connect the two? And so I connected the two and that's what the yellow project was. That's where the yellow project came from. And then, so now we connected the cloud photo with this one because they're kind of connected. We got clouds, but we got the trail stuff. And then you got me going down the trail to the corn. And then all of a sudden I'm in the corn. And then I go through the corn to here. <gasps> I'm going somewhere. And I eventually get to the final destination. <gasps> okay, so that was the plan. That was the story. There was a whole story going on. We're in the same situation. I need to figure out how to connect these two, this one and this one. They need to connect somehow. And plus that'll give me an extra photo to fill out this project so I can make multiple parts. So we need one more photo. Hold on, do the room photo. To make, uh, that'll be completely black and white. Let me cut to this one where it's partially black and white but the outside slowly creeping in with the color and then it's color no there's too much i feel like there still needs to be a connection between these two idea a flower photo we pull out the classic flower photo flower okay the ant has a bunch of flowers too around her house, but the calendar garden. <gasps> I could find a colorful flower at the calendar garden because then I, I could do a flower and it slowly starts to make me color again. And then boom, we end with me all nice and colorful at the park. <gasps> That's it. That's the story. Yes. So we're black and white down there. And then we go to this one where I'm in the same position. So then we be curled up on the floor here. Or we go to here, all of a sudden I'm outside, curled up on the floor, same thing. And then we get to a flower. And then the slowly making me color. We end with 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 that. Okay. That's the story. Boom. That's the story. I just realized the shoot that I'm doing today is right next to the park that has that bridge so i can do the photo today it's about 86 degrees outside yeah might as well just get it done today because then i don't have to go over there shoot the photo and then drive all the way to the aunt's house shoot the photo i could just go to the aunt's house you know tomorrow Ugh. oh what kind of people is selling that way that's where I got that photo. The railing's a little taller than I thought, actually. I don't think it's gonna see me. This isn't gonna work. You're not gonna see me at all. This is all me. Like, this isn't gonna work. I was like, jump over. <laughs> jump over, stick right there. <laughs> if you can see, there's a, there's a shoe in it. There's a shoe in it. Why is there a shoe? I, I'm gonna at least attempt. I'm gonna fly the drone. See what it looks like. No, oh, I can't. I can't go over there in the middle part. This way. Just fly it up and take a look. See if I can see. See if I can see me. Authorization zone. Oh, I can't fly here. This is actually in a lot more restricted airspace. Oh. Interesting. It makes sense because the planes always fly over the brother's house coming into land. The airport's just right over there. So I'm just too close to the airport. And I'm in the landing zone where they fly down to land. So, yeah. 
Who dis? Oh, who dis? You can take it up the whole bed. Anyways, well, today's Sunday. I was going to shoot the photos today, and I still am. But I've just taken my time. But it's only 1 o'clock, and the aunt's house is only 45 minutes away. So I'm going to get there by 2 anyways. Shoot the photo, and come back. I'll be back by 3. <laughs> so, once I stop at the calendar, I'm two. Hi there. So you're connected to the iPad. So I'm going to put you up on the ceiling. And we'll shoot the photo before I leave for in here. I'm not going to stage anything. I'm going to leave everything how it is. Oh, okay. Now I have this nice thread. It should support the GoPro just fine. Ta-da! It's beautiful. It's a top-down. Stay. Oh, because the GoPro is over. The GoPro is... Yeah. Ah. Drop you. You have been dropped. There we go. There we go. There we go. I'm gonna start screen recording on the iPad so you can see what I'm doing. Because the GoPro is gonna be in photo mode, so I can't really record video in photo mode. I think did a long exposure there. Can I see it? Oh, I can, I can. Oh yeah, look at all the noise. A night photo. Oh, it's gorgeous. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's gorgeous. Look at it. Compared to that or this one. Oh my goodness. And also, it was using the GoPro color, which is why it was so saturated. So I changed the color balance to just be normal. And I turned down the ISO. Look at me, it's normal, not so bad. That's it, that's it. You got this photo? It's. 3 o'clock, should get to the aunt's house by 3.45 and shoot that one photo. I want the sun to be a little lower, so if I do do a photo with a road and the drone to be walking down a road, I would want to have a shadow at least. That's why I'm waiting till a little bit later, so. Okay, we've got options. I spotted some dirt roads while I was coming here. There's a few dirt roads that I could use. There's a house over here just down this road that I did, that I did aerials for. It was on a dirt road. But my fear for here is that there's people. Sure enough, you know, well, there's three cars. There's only three. We'll walk around first. We won't take anything in. We'll just walk around and see. Mm. Those yellow ones would work. Those would work. Aunt already has those. But why do I have to do a real flower? Could I just buy a fake flower? I wonder if the ant has any fake flowers. I'll have to go through her stuff. <laughs> oh, she's got the birds. She's got like a bunch of fake birds that I used for a photo for red. We're gonna go and look at that road where I did this house. This is a good spot. A bunch of trees. Nobody's gonna see me right here. This could work. Here's a pretty good spot too, right here. Here's a pretty good spot before all the trees. all I really need. I'm good. I'm happy.
glad I got it done. I wore the black because I'm not quite in the color yet. I gotta get to the holding the thing part and that would be the color part. The background's gonna be blurred, but I at least wanna have some green back there. Anyways, probably not gonna do it here, but I'll at least grab the prop, bring it back home with me, and I can shoot it at home. We've got that row of trees in the front yard that I could use as a nice background. What's in here? Hey, hey, hey. These are fake. Sure, she won't mind if I steal this. Really, honestly, I think that flower is going to work. The bird might be a little bit too weird. There's the birds. There they are. I'll open this up. Come here, birds. <laughs> sure, she won't mind. We're good to go. That's it. That's all I need. Oh, hi. You just caught me outside looking around at the puppy clouds. Oh, wow. Look at the puppy clouds. There seems to be a storm of brewing over there. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Look at there. Look at there it is. Here it is. Look at that. It'd be a twister. Right there. Going in. Going in. Can't stop me. Going in. Don't you drag me away. Hold it. And I think. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. hit once. They've already been hit once. Poor things. Oh no. I'm going in. I'm tired of this. I am the pro. Who cares about saying I'm pro? I am the pro. I am the pro. Oh. Hey. I actually didn't break the car that time. Hold on. I can get a double tornado. Hold on. 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 Oh, would you look at that. Wow. I was born to do this. I am the probe. I don't care about your fence. Your fence is gonna get destroyed anyways. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Woo! There we go. We're off. I gotta hit it around. I hit it around. Get out. Get out. Here. I don't care. I am the probe. GoPro. That. Oh. Deactivate. Reactivate. I've got two cameras. I've got two cameras. It's actually, it's actually not bad. I've got, I can use the GoPro as a webcam now. I could just like use the jaws clamp and just clamp it over there. Lens mode. Oh. You can change the lens mode? What about super view? Can I go to super view with this thing? Oh, it's resetting. Hold on. Okay. You can see too much. You can see too much. Yeah. It's just same as bot. You can see the same amount of stuff. Anyways, this is a good test. Good test. Good test. Good test. I'm happy. I do like how I can change it too. Like if I want to, I could just go over here and just change it to super view. But you'll see it go away. And then it'll come back. <laughs> But you can see the screen. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's a bit too much. I was just comparing the two. Like, look, look at that. And then, look at that. Like, look at all that no- I'm up- I can't even tell it's me with all that noise! Even though, if I do go with this, I'll have a weird look. Like, I crank up the contrast. It's gonna be black and white, so make it black and white, crank everything up, it'll be gritty, weird, and... Giving me, um, pictorial. Same style! Same vibe! It's got the same vibe, same style. Fancy. Or we could just toss in some grain on this. What would happen if I do that? Let's make it black and white. What effects? Toss in some grain. 
See? Same thing. But I've got control. Oh. The before and after is always the best. Oh. Anyways, so there's that. I uh, now we need the aerial photo. Walking or starting to walk. I like this one. It's that it just feels like something else is going on besides me just walking. Because I've I've been walking so many different places. My goodness. Half my photos are just me walking. So this one's kind of different. This one looks kind of different. It's like I'm starting to walk. Normally for the photos, I'm already walking, but this one's like, I'm starting. It's different. I eventually look into the flower and whatnot. So yes, I like that one. But I thought about when I was out there and have it like, I'm still in the black and white, but the other half of the photo is color. But and I'm walking towards the other half. Maybe it's more of a triangle kind of thing going on. I... It's not that bad. The first one was a circle, just me in the middle. But now it's like I'm trying to break through the black and white into the color area. Yeah. You can get up there. There's a space. You can get up there. I wonder if I set this to super and be able to see. Oh, you can! Wow! There he is! Oh, here comes the other one. Oh, here comes the other one. Oh, look at the other one! Who this? It's gone! There it goes. See, once again, all these layers for these photos, for this project, there's like a lot of stuff going on behind the scenes. Multiple layers, multiple masks going on. Like, there's some things. Boom. I'm in the room. Just, uh, All of a sudden, <gasps> I'm teleported outside. Oh. But I'm still, uh. So then I go out walking, searching for something that's not, uh, And I find the flower. And then I find the flower, and I'm like, oh. And then I'm happy. Ah. There he is. He had issues a while ago. He couldn't get in the bed because he's getting so old. His bones, his bones. I'll be back tomorrow. Hi there, we're sideways. Yeah, right there is the spot. We just passed an important milestone. We passed over a thousand houses. I've been to a thousand houses. Do I need to get into bed first? I guess I will. Oh my stars, he did it! Holy cow, there he is! We got two good ones. I'll go with this one. I like this one. I think we got a photo. It tells a story. Here we are. It's done. It's done. When I first did the videos, I put them all on the timeline before I shot any of the photos. And it was seven hours. I got that down to about an hour. 
and I was halfway through that hour. I was at 30 minutes with an hour left. And then I put in all these videos where I shot the photo and I edited the photos. And it bumped it up to 13 hours, 12 hours, eh, 12 and a half. And I got it back down. We finally edited it all again, got it all whittled down to an hour and 16. That's shorter than the Yellow Project. The Yellow Project was an hour and a half. Wow. But the first edit pass, I'm going to go back through and edit everything again. And then now that I know how many photos I have, I've got five, I can split it up and split it up into five parts. Once I get it all edited, I want the whole thing to be edited as one whole thing. And then we'll trim it up. I was just looking at all the photos, comparing the past stuff with what I just did. Because I feel like these photos were a bit more artistic than usual. Like they're telling a story, but it's a bit more obvious that there's a story. Like the Yellow Project, there was a story, but it wasn't like, story, here it is. You know, this, it's just like, there it is, there's a story. Yeah. Is it too artistic? And so I was looking and seeing if it was too artistic. I was comparing with what I've done before. I've done artistic stuff before. Oh, like we've got this one, and we've got this one. There's an art artsy one. Look at that. Like this one, which I mentioned, which would have worked great for this project. Would have been perfect to have, right? But uh, no, these big flowers are gone. This one? artsy. So, yeah, this isn't the first time I've been artistic. And I was also seeing how these photos would stand out with the other photos, because you can tell the ones that stand out. Usually the ones with black backgrounds, you can see them from a mile away, especially these ones, because they're vertical. I like how the ones where I have a black background are vertical. Like, these ones are vertical, this, these ones aren't. But these ones are vertical. And they're in a studio. They look different. You can tell. This one, though, this one just, you can see that from a mile away, just like, oh, there it is. 477, which means this one's, these ones are 478, 79, 80, 81, 82, 482. Ooh. Ooh. I'm happy that I actually got this video cut down. <laughs> there was me thinking of a birthday photo. Because I was on that bridge, and I was like, well, maybe that random bridge photo could be a birthday photo, but I couldn't fly anyways. So there was that, and so I wanted this project to be started before the birthday photo, and then we do the birthday photo, and then it continues after. But it took so long to get this whittled down and edited that it's August 1st, so we got four days till the birthday. The first photo, the black and white photo, as a birthday photo, because it's, it's not the first time I've done a moody birthday photo like it's dark and moody because I just didn't feel I just felt ugh, on my birthday so same thing here I've been feeling eh. so maybe it should be the birthday photo and then I also cut out the reason why I was feeling so moody because it's been five months I wasn't feeling a hundred percent so I just didn't do a photo because I wasn't feeling anything I do a photo when I'm feeling something I just wasn't feeling anything and then what I cut out of this video, the grandfather. The grandfather. Oh, I get a phone call from my mom saying, uh, the grandfather's going to the hospital. He had an accident. He fell and just split his head open. He was bleeding everywhere. Oh, great. Oh, that's wonderful. And then when he was in the hospital, they found out he's got leukemia in the blood. So, well, that's just wonderful, too. So they feel like... They couldn't treat him well enough here, so they shipped him off to Indianapolis, and that's where he's been. So, that just put me in a sour mood, too. Like, it's just... Uh... But now he's doing better. They've got him down there. They're treating him. He's getting much, much better. The grandmother's down there with him. She was up here. My mom was staying with her. And now my mom's back home because the aunt finally came back home. Because when I was at the aunt's house, she wasn't there. She was visiting her daughter and the aunt aunt, the great aunt down in Louisiana. And so she finally came back to be with the grandfather. And also the great aunt came up too. The, the aunt aunt is up here as well. Interesting. And so since they came back, 
they came, got the grandmother, and they all went to Indianapolis. And so my mom came back home. So there was a shuffle of people everywhere. But long story short, everybody's down in Indianapolis taking care of the grandfather. He's doing better. So since he was doing better, I was feeling better. And that's when I started doing these photos. But now I'm feeling better. And I got this video done. And I'm just, oh, I'm relaxing. We're done. I'm done. But now what? <laughs> now what? I don't know. I have no idea what to do now. Maybe I should go through some old photos. I got a bunch of old photos back cataloged. Like really old photos. Maybe I should go through those and see what I can do. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do next. Hopefully there's not another five month gap. But I have a feeling there's going to be. Because I don't know what to do. <sighs> Thank you for watching. Enjoy the photos. Go to the blog. I need to work on the vlog. I haven't touched the vlog this whole entire time. I need to make sure the vlog is okay. <laughs>